Hi, Vero with uh, Stock Market Live TV. Well, today we are going to discuss uh, to William uh, this IPO and uh, why uh, we have to you as a strong buy and why do I think this stock or this company has to be in your portfolio. Firstly, I'm going to start by saying that we have this chart here. To you it is an IPO. As you are aware, I'm an expert in financial markets. I'm going to follow up to you We have a long position, a strong buy rating, an investment position since uh, uh, $25 average price. In the end, 25 or 26, it does not matter, it is the same. We let to will you, uh, this is a chart that is public. It is on the website uh, tradingview.com. We let uh, uh, to will you start trading. We have three days of trading. Going forward, I believe that is rather important uh, to confirm whether you are going to obtain a pattern of higher lows. This is the case precisely so far within the first three days. Why within the first three days? Well, I discovered this in detail when I uh, taught you how to invest in GoPro since uh, uh, IPO, the very first day. And I promised that you would become a millionaire investing in GoPro according to my real-time guidance. I also promise that if you follow my guidance, you can uh, eventually become a millionaire investing in uh, uh, Twilio. And I'm going to start by saying that Twilio, I know this company for many years, many years before the uh, IPO. Uh, Twilio it is one of our uh, partners, uh, as it is uh, Amazon Web Service. Why do I mention Amazon Web Service? Because Twilio, it is, in my personal opinion, I repeat, in my personal opinion, the example that I find the most comparable in the industry, in the sense that what Twilio does, no one else does. So, for example, ourselves at StockMarketLive.tv, in particular my own case, what I do, no one else can do it. All right? So what Twilio does, no one else can do it. If someone tells you that Twilio has competition, they are lying. Twilio does not have any competition whatsoever. Not only because they have people uh, who I know, <coughs> which are, who are experts, and uh, they are a leading company, they, it's very technical, and the performance of the stock uh, uh, going forward or in the future, it will depend pretty much, in my personal view, whether Wall Street or investors in general, they will perceive that in fact they are before a unique opportunity, as I addressed uh, the case of Amazon many years ago uh, when I had the highest target in the world. Uh, today, Amazon uh, is a stock trading at $700. Well, uh, many years ago, in 2009, I, I, I didn't visualize that Amazon will be trading at uh, $700, but nevertheless, uh, I had the highest target in the world in Amazon. Uh, well, in Twilio, I think that I have the highest target in the world in Twilio. So I think that you should buy shares while they are weak, and if they fall, I think that you should buy more instead of trading or day trading uh, the stock, okay? So with regards, I repeat, uh, the performance of the stock going forward, it will depend pretty much, since I'm, my role in the markets is to read the markets, but it will depend pretty much on whether investors out there, they will perceive, in fact, the intrinsic value of this uh, uh, company. So uh, if you wish a price target, and I'm going to mention here a number, but bear in mind that we do not invest or trade according to price targets, okay? So this is very important. We have to confirm uh, daily, in particular an IPO, whether it will be possible to achieve in the short, mid or long term, eventually, that price target, okay? And the position sizing, and the way that I'm going to discuss Twilio, as I did in the case of Twitter, 
uh, I don't know, Facebook, uh, Google, and many other GoPro and many other IPOs, GroPro. We are going to follow it since the very first day because it is a rather important company for us, okay? So the price target that I'm going to give you is $45, okay? That is the upside that uh, eventually I consider that it will be feasible in uh, uh, Twilio. If you ask me whether this is possible on the short term, my answer is uh, unlikely, okay? Unlikely it is uh, possible in the short term. But I think that you have to follow up the stock and uh, to see what is going to happen, okay? And then we are going to make updates with regards to uh, how to invest in Twilio, all right? As we did in the case of GoPro and many other stocks, more than one leading companies that we followed here since uh, IPO. What else to say? Uh, that is critical that you have a long position an investment position in Twilio ahead of everyone else. Because if for some reason shares they start moving higher, uh, we are not going to buy the stock. We are going just to follow it and we can buy at certain pivots that we consider support pivots. But if you want to have an investment position, you should acquire an investment position right now, uh, in my personal opinion. Okay, so this is up to you. Uh, I don't have any further comments. This chart, it is public on the website tradingview.com. We have a long position. You can see it here uh, on uh, uh, the screen. And uh, I don't have uh, any, anything else to say other than uh, Twilio eventually might be uh, one of the best stocks to invest in. Uh, because I don't visualize, for example, Apple to gain more than 1% or Amazon to gain more 1%, or Facebook to gain more than 1%, and I'm referring to Netflix to gain more than 1%, okay? So with regards also to these companies, companies that everyone else knows or is aware of, uh, you also have the full investment process described here. And I'm going to finalize by saying that uh, one of the reasons also to buy or to have a long position in Twitter is precisely what I've just said that everyone knows Amazon, everyone knows Facebook, everyone knows, you know, Apple, but how many do they know Twilio? Very few, you understand? Very few they understand or Twilio, very, very few they know Twilio, and I think that this is the, probably the most or the best reason for you to owe Twilio, all right? With regards to the financials of the company and... Uh, uh, metrics, fundamentals, price to earnings, and so on. I will not care much with regards to this matter, and I'm going to tell you why. Very simple. I already discovered this also on the website, several investment lessons. Uh, still today, uh, the Federal Reserve is pumping ma uh, f uh, money into the markets. And, you know, we are talking about trillions, so uh, I already said this when in uh, several investment lessons that the U.S. stock market is likely to remain rigged. That is the term that I use until U.S. elections. But we also see some, uh, uh, quite frankly, signs of uh, uh, deterioration in the U.S. stock market, and you have to be careful. But uh, when I mention with regards to uh, uh, fundamentals, uh, well, to will you, it is, it is a small company, okay? They went public precisely to evolve, uh, looking at the future, uh, helping themselves also to fund, okay? I think this is very important. Also, it's going to more people, more companies, they are going to be aware about Twilio. They are going to join. They are also going to subscribe. Uh, and it's very imp it was a very important decision for Twilio to become public, okay? This is a critical major component. That it was, the, for example, the case with... Uh, uh, Facebook and other companies, all right? So, um, this is what I have to say. Uh, I wish you good luck investing in uh, uh, Twilio in the future. And don't forget that one of the most important things for, to be a successful investor is that you have to be aware of these companies before IPO, okay? 
I know to will you well before IPO. I know all the details about the company. For me, I feel very confident with regards to my, let's say, personal view. Whether it will be correct or not, that will be a market judgment, all right? My role is to read the markets, is not, or to interpret the markets, is not to believe, let's say, in myself, all right? But I feel confident with regards to my view. Um, and that's it, all right? Good luck investing in Twilio. Thank you.